haven't they received an email, letter, phone call, or anything, you know, afterwards. Instead, they just right away grabbed me and threw me out, like as if, as if this is the, kind of like an excuse they're waiting for to get rid of that goddamn Jew. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, that's how it looked to me, you know. Um, again, I mean, like, uh, you know, um, the, the CEO happens to be an older um, African-American man, um, unfortunately, you have people like Jesse Jackson and Louis, Far Louis Farrakhan and so on um, who are anti-Semitic. You know, whether this person, my CEO, my former CEO, has that kind of attitude or not, I mean, you know, I can only guess. I, I, I've never seen him in person. I don't know what I'm saying. But I just thought it was interesting how they handled it. And again, with, with no warning, I mean, normally you would give an employee a warning. Okay, right. like in the future, if you do this again, you're fired. No, I was on the spot. I, I couldn't go back to my cubicle to get my briefcase. You know, so it was, again, I mean, so there are certainly people who are not Jewish or not Orthodox who are not fans of Jacob Stein. I'm totally cool with that. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And, um, you know, that's the way it is, you know. But, uh, okay. anyway, I, I've got to so, run. I've got to, yeah, I've got yeah, to. I've got sure, to run yeah, I'm also got to. Good. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll also do a few things. I've got to, what do you say, it's almost Tisha Bob also. I've got to, uh, what do you say, maybe have a little bit of tea or something, whatever. But uh, okay. anyway, 